Now we are going to introduce the body systems most relevant to exercise and fitness, which are discussed in depth in other sessions. But let's have a sneak preview. The skeletal system is composed of bones, ligaments, cartilage and joints. And its role is to provide support, protection, movement, cell formation and storage. The muscular system contains all the muscles and tendons of the body. The role of this system is to provide movement, posture and production of heat. The nervous system contains the brain, spinal cord, sensory organs and nerves. The nervous system enables communication between the brain and the body and provides sensory feedback. The respiratory system is everything to do with exchange of gas, in other words, breathing, and the regulation of the acid-base balance of the blood. It contains the nose, pharynx, larynx, trachea, bronchi, and the lungs. The cardiovascular system contains the heart and all the blood vessels in the body. Its job is to transport substances around the body. It helps with the regulation of body temperature and helps with immunity. The digestive system includes primary structures like the mouth, stomach and intestines and accessory structures like the teeth, tongue and pancreas. The digestive system is responsible for the breakdown of food, absorption of nutrients and the elimination of waste products. Finally, the endocrine system. This exceptionally important system contains all the glands in the body such as the hypothalamus, thyroid and adrenal glands. These glands all produce and secrete hormones which regulate most things in the body, for example metabolism, growth and development, regulate reproductive function and establish body rhythms.